Well, the rookie lifestyle is not all about the dollar dollar bills, it's also about challenges. And here on NBA XL, we created the ultimate challenge. We sent our very own rookie reporter, Akil Augustine, to Utah's shoot around for a one on one with Morris Amon. Let's see how well he did here on NBA XL. With the 25th pick in the 2007 NBA Draft, the Utah Jazz select Morris Almond from Rice University. What's going on? This is your freshman, Akil Agassino. Right now, I'm with one of the 07-08 freshmen, Morris Almond of the Utah Jazz. Morris, what's good? Hey, what's going on, man? Morris Almond takes the shot. Sweet, smooth. Two for two shooting for the man they call Almond Joy. So I got a question for you here. At one point last year at Rice, you averaged 28 points per game. What's that feel like? It feels good to, you know, be able to put uh, numbers on the stat sheet. You know, your shot's going, and, uh, you know, it's a good feeling. You just want to keep it going, you know, every game. He does have a scorer's mentality. Uh, he's got long arms. He's got big hands. He, I think he can play on the offensive end right now. You didn't have the ordinary childhood coming up. From what I hear, you were if this term applies, quote unquote, an army brat? Our family is originally from Georgia. You know, that's about 15 minutes outside of Atlanta. Yeah. So, you know, our family, that's home base. But, uh, you know, my younger years, that's about the eighth grade. Germany, Ohio, Kansas City, all over the country. So, uh, you know, definitely, you know, I'm cultured. Oh, damn, you're jet setting from an early age. Okay, so what else would Morris Alman be doing that he's really dedicated to? If I wasn't playing basketball, probably still be in school. You know, I'm out of graduate school. I went to Rice, so that's a lot of people do, so I've always did that. Okay, so what's the one thing you took from your years at Rice that you think is helping you out in the NBA right now? You know, college, you grow, you know, on and off the floor. You know, you mature as a man. When I first got to college, you know, one getting a lot of playing time, first time away from home, and, uh, you know, going through a lot of the same things, you know, making transition to the NBA. So, um, you know, kind of seasons you a little bit, so when you, you know, transition out into another league, you know, you've seen some of the things before. Two rookies, uh, Morris Allman and Krilo Fasinko, made their rookie debuts last night, and really the crowd on hand, I think they liked what they saw. Okay, so these uh, these Utah Jazz, Darren Williams, AK-47, O'Kerr, this Morris Almond kid, they're, they're pretty good. How good are these Jazz? We had a heck of a year last year, you know, going to the Western Conference Finals, and honestly, while we can't do it again this year, uh, you know, I'll go even further. I usually get a lot of advice from my friends of who's going to be Rookie of the Year, who's going to win this, who's going to win that. I want to get it from a player. So first up, first question is, because you're in the West, I'm not going to ask you, but who's winning the East? Detroit's always up there. Toronto's definitely a contender. Power move to the rim! Boston. Uh, it's definitely up in the air. Well, Morris Almond, this is a freshman. Thank you so much for coming out. Respect, and uh, have a great year. Hey, pleasure to meet you. All right. That's it.